hello guys welcome to my channel first of all i would like to tell you guys about my experiences with orange pi pc please try not to skip this video and i would recommend you to watch this video till the end if you also made mistake of purchasing orange pi pc even if you haven't purchased it yet or if you're planning to purchase it please do watch it till the end so without taking much of your time i would like to begin Two months back I purchased Orange 5 PC from AliExpress along with free wireless adapter 802.11N at just 23 bucks or 1515 Indian National Rupees and it came to me 30 days after the order and luckily on testing everything was working fine. At first I was afraid that I got a faulty board, but it was just a corrupted image. So let's get over to the main point, and that is image. The procedure given on orangepi.org for the installation of image onto SD card is quite simple and quick. But the actual culprit is outdated images that are given by the official page. There are two main bugs in the images of Orange Pi PC except one image that is called Linux. The two bugs are corrupted wireless driver, corrupted LAN driver or Ethernet driver. That means you cannot connect to internet and in Linux no internet connection means useless OS. I also tried images given by Loboris but unfortunately the bugs still persist in those images. But at last there was a lifesaver operating system already present out there. And that was Ambien. On installation Ambien onto SD card, it worked smoothly and LAN connection was also working, but still it has faulty driver of wireless adapter. Every time I connect to any wireless connection, wireless network of any wireless network, my Orange Pi PC rebooted itself. So at last with the help of Ambien form, I fixed wireless driver issue now to help you all guys i have prepared backup of my ambient sd card that is you just have to download it from the description and install it using win32 disk imager if you're using windows hr in ubuntu or linux or you can also install it using the way given on orange by pc tf card installation as you can see my wireless adapter light is blinking that means it is working properly now i will show you guys that wireless adapter is working first of all i will disconnect my lan connection and see i was already connected my home Wi-Fi network that is named as YouTuber uh, now I'll show you that my wireless adapter is working properly Here you can see Ambient official page. Now I'll show you by typing Google. See, Google is working. I will also install various programs like uh, Arduino IDE, Python Ideal, Genie, and uh, I will also install GPIO library. Let me show you 
working GPA library. I disliked its terminal, so I installed LX terminal that I have been using in uh, my Lubuntu that is installed onto my laptop. Now I will show you GPIO is working. GPIO space read all. This command will show you the state of all the GPIO pins that are present on uh, Orange Pi PC board. See that you can say physical 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and the values are values of one pin is not defined, values of third pin is 0, value of fifth pin is 0. Similarly, you can see without using an LED values of uh, pin different pins of orange by pc without using an led now i will show you um, that how you can change these value you can change this value using simple code i have already made a code i just have to execute it so i will write sudo python test dot py I will enter sudo password so I will open another terminal so that I can show you the results You, you can see this fifth pin just focus on fifth pin sorry third pin the pin above fifth pin that is third pin this physical third pin one two three the value of third pin is changing see it's now zero now it's one now it's zero now it's one similarly this works now let me show you the code that is python code here is the code i have just used this code you just have to type this code and you can um, change the value of gpio pins first of all you have to import the library next you have to use the function gpio.init that will initialize the gpio module then i have used i is equal to 9 then I have set the configuration port P812 that I have uh, already shown you that is uh, pin number third and I have uh, also declared it into output mode. Now I have um, written while i is greater than 0 that is I have made a for endless loop then it will execute continuously and it will never end then in the loop section I have declared gpio.output that is port and its state is high next after 2 seconds it will be low and then it will give a gap of 3 seconds then it will again then it will execute continuously and this loop will never end so thank you guys for watching my video i hope you guys found, found this video informative if you guys like it please do like and subscribe